hi guys welcome to my youtube channel in today's video we will learn about the pdf actions in power automate desktop so please watch this video till the end so that you can understand them completely so let's get started so the first action that we will learn is extract images from the pdf okay so in this action what we have to do is we have to provide the pdf file path right and then we have to also tell that with it whether you want to extract the image from all the pages or one page or you want to specify some custom uh, range right so if you want to provide the range then you'll have to you'll have to specify how do you want to from which page to which page you want to extract right so you have to specify the page number page number one page number three like this and then if you want to give the image name that also you can give and then you can specify the path of where this image will be saved so first what we will do is we will select the all okay and here i will click on this icon to select the file so here i have chosen the path of the file right and then i have to tell the image name okay so image name i will give based on the date and time okay so i'll show you how you can uh, provide the name based on the date and time so i will click on save okay and then i will pull an action called get date time just search date and from here I can get current date time and then I will say I need date and time and that will be stored in the current date time variable then I will click on save and then I will take this action to convert date time to the text right and from here i will choose the variable current date time and then i want to choose the custom uh, method to format the date time okay and let's say i want to first put date then underscore then month right and then year and then i want to get the hours minutes seconds okay and that will be stored in the formatted date time if you want to modify this variable name you can modify that as well and then i will click on save right and now i will come back to this place open the extract images from the pdf and here i'll give the path as uh, image name as pdf image and then i want to use the variable and i will give one more underscore here right and then i will click on this icon to select the folder where i want to save all the images from this file and here i have chosen the path of the folder and then in the advanced section you'll have to you can provide the password if your document needs a password right so now i will click on save and then i will run the bot the execution is completed right and uh, now i can check the folder 
where I have saved all the images from this file. So here you can see that all the images from that file is extracted, right? So now when you see here that this is the image which has been extracted from the file, right? So like this you can extract images from the PDF file and store it into a variable. Even when you see the file name, this is coming exactly the way we wanted it. So it is PDF underscore image and then underscore, you know, the date and then the month and then year, then time 07, 11, 52 and then 8 seconds. You see 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Like this, all the files have been named in the same format the way we wanted it, right? So now what I will do is I will delete this action and we'll check the next action in the PDF category. We'll go to the PDF and then here I have an option to choose extract text from the PDF, right? And here also I have to provide the path and I can provide the range, right? And in the advanced section, if your document requires a password, you need to provide the password and the data will be stored in the extracted PDF text. So I will click on this icon to select the file. So here I have chosen the path of the file and then I will click on save. Right. And if you want to delete these two actions, we can delete these two actions. But for now, I will keep it like this only. I will run the bot. And now if you come to extracted PDF text, you see that all the text from that file is extracted, right? So like this, you can use this extract text from the PDF action to get a to get all the text from the PDF. I will close this. So the next action is extract PDF file pages to new PDF file, right? So here also what you have to do is you have to provide the path of the file, right? And then you have to also specify the path of the file where the new extracted PDF file will be stored, right? So I'll click on this icon to select the file. Here I have selected the file and then I can specify the page selection. So if you click on this little icon, you can specify the path. So I will just say that, okay, I want first page and you have to specify the extracted PDF file path. So I can, what I can do is, I can select on this, uh, click on this link to select the path. Here also I've selected the path of the file. And then if file exists, what do we want to do? Do we want to overwrite? Or do we not want to perform any action? Or do we want to add sequential suffix? So I'll just keep it suffix one. In the advanced section, you can provide the password if required, and then I can click on save. Now, when I run the bot, you will see the result. As you can see, here you can see that another file is created, right? And it is named as 2 because the file is already there and it is only one page, right? Because we wanted only first page to be extracted. 
So if you like this video, please click on the like button and please subscribe my YouTube channel. And if you have any question, please post it in the comment section. Thank you for watching.